everybody, this is the Black Owl, the Owl King, you know what, this video is going to be different, I'm just going to post a video at something that I want to talk to everybody about, my feelings, emotions, and you know, all that type of uh, baby stuff. And before we get started and everything, how is all my Black Hour brothers and sisters doing? How's the Owl family doing? I hope everybody's doing okay. And there, there have been a conversation I wanted to talk to y'all about. Yeah, there have been a couple conversations I wanted to talk to y'all about. Right? Um, if anybody watched this video, for any for any type of reason, I want I want to tell y'all that basically, I don't do this for money, entertainment, or any of them. I I do this. I make YouTube videos, TikToks, and play games like this to have a peace of mind. And I think that's the most important thing for somebody to have. It's a peace of mind. And that doesn't sound like me. <laughs> that sounds something like Son Miriam would say. And if any of y'all would ask, who is Miriam? It's basically <laughs> me, but. In a different mindset. Just like Fat. He's me. But a different mindset. I'm Grin. The Black Owl. The Owl who. Has. Deep. Angry. And suffering emotions. Somebody who. Is basically. He doesn't see the world. As all happiness. And sunshines and rainbows. No. He sees the world as. The ocean. God I hate the ocean. <laughs> I mean. I have both subnautical games. And. For some particular reason. It gets to a point. Where I get too scared. To keep on playing. Because the fear of drowning is it's one of my top fears. And I guess that's a lot of people's fear is the ocean. And I get that. Because the freaking ocean is freaking scary. And nobody don't want to see the ocean. Especially not me. The ocean is just freaking terrifying. And knowing that, not only is the ocean is freaking terrifying, there's a whole bunch of stuff we don't know about. We know more about space than we know the ocean. And this space is way bigger than the ocean. And you telling me y'all not a little bit terrified of water? Right? And... Why did I bring up the ocean, right? Why did I bring up that I was terrified about the ocean, right? <laughs> that's that's for a different time and a different story. Because uh, I tell you the truth, that that story is kind of traumatizing. It is traumatizing. <laughs> I mean, it traumatized me. But back back to what I was saying. Basically, I know I haven't been persistent in making videos. I haven't been persistent in doing a lot of things. Right? And one of the reasons for that is because I'm a very emotional person. And then, and 
before any of y'all say, what does that got to do with anything? I'm a very emotional person. Where my emotions will literally go in the deep end and... I forget who is me. Why is me? Is this me? And <laughs> I know it sounds crazy. I mean, shoot. I think myself sounds a bit crazy by now. <laughs> But, I don't see just how things are. I see that basically, you just be you. Alright? And... I guess that gets to a point where, oh, you sound like a complete idiot. What you mean, you just be you? That's exactly what I meant. You just be you. Oh, shoot. <sighs> so, we were building up juggernauts. But yeah, knowing that my worst thing is being persistent. Because nine times out of ten, I'm not the persistent person. And I would never claim to be. I am motivated. And... Really don't care what I have to lose to get what I want. But above all that, I have a lot of love. And I think there were my biggest problem comes in. Me having a lot of love. Because having a lot of love, basically, is the one of the most worst things that can happen to anybody. And I guess the reason I say that is because love is one of the most dangerous weapons. Hmm. And I love it's such a dangerous weapon. Right? I have I have a lot of love for uh, YouTube and video games. One of the one of the main reasons why I started YouTube and video gaming. Cause I love them. Right? Then I hit that stage where I had emotional and abandonment issues. And no, not by my parents, by somebody I care about. And I'll be honest with you. I tell myself, stop complaining. Anytime I get like that, I start making YouTube videos. See if that will calm me down. It does for a time. But...
being calm and being happy is two different things, right? And I want to focus on being happy, that part of my life. I mean, it's not where it's not that I care a lot, basically. I care too much about what people think of me, how people see my influence as and then I care about how much people actually love me. I give her I get anytime I date somebody I give them all my heart. Not just some, not just parts, not even snippets. All of it. I know it sounds crazy. <laughs> Be honest with you. I think that's the problem. I do too much crazy things. And there's not enough people to help me with me going crazy. I should go ahead and attack. I can see my goal of winning in right in front of my eyes. I see that I see the success. But what is success if you're not happy? And being happy is something that I value. And I guess. It just took me a lot of time to let go. And I don't want it to take anybody else that much time to let go. If you have a chance to let go, do it. And that's all my brothers and sisters, my our brothers and sisters. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, and show me, show, show me the support that I don't gotta ride this trip alone, and I won't ride this trip alone. Talk to you later, my owl family. I love everybody. I love myself.